Well, hello dear friends and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Today, um, something interesting is happening, okay? Let me just have my drink here and before starting things off I wanted to say that welcome to today's uh, special episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. It seems it's uh, already starting pretty great and... Okay. Okay. You don't leave, I'll make you leave. That's simple. Oh damn! Why can't you writers leave it at the door? Okay, I think it's going down already. Damn! What is he doing? Okay. Oh, oh yeah. Now I get it. Okay, you want to see these hands? There you go. Go ahead. Oh damn, that was a nasty hit, dude. Okay, that was nice, dude. <laughs> see, that's what happens. Maybe that's uh, not a good idea. Maybe I should have not drank that whiskey before fighting with people. Not at the same time. Oh, I don't want to choke him. There you go. That's way better. <laughs> what the hell did I just do? Mate, you got knocked the F out. Yeah. I also got a bonus in health for doing this. Jesus Christ. As I was saying, ladies and gentlemen, before being rudely interrupted, welcome to today's episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. We are going to commit a lot of crimes in today's video. This was just, you know, random encounters, but uh, we have actually a purpose today that we need to fulfill, and that is, as I was saying, a certain robbery, or should I say, a certain event. It's uh, right here, south of Rhodes. It's pretty interesting. You can also visit it like later on. I'm pretty sure there is a mission regarding it. But I'm going to visit it a little bit earlier this time around because I want to get something from over there. There's a little bit of money in it, a couple of secrets, and most importantly, a hidden shotgun. So yeah, we're going to go there right now. I'm just going to get my uh, trusty old horse. And uh, yeah, let's see, where do we need to go? Okay, there's some poop on the ground. You know what? Actually, there is a lot of shit in this town. Look at this. All over the place. Jesus. But as I was saying, we need to go over there. There is a son and his father over there. They're probably going to do some wild stuff. I'm not really sure what because they are kind of unpredictable. But uh, yeah, just running through the fields, ruining people's crops. And uh, you know what? Actually, wait a minute. There is another cabin here. Where is this? It's still in the woods and it's called the Old Harry Fen. Unless I'm reading that wrong. You know what? I'm actually going to pay this one a visit as well. It's a mild interruption of our episode. But I'm going to check it nonetheless. Hopefully there is nobody inside. And it definitely looks like nobody inhabited this for quite a while now. So I'm just going to go inside. Uh, I'm unarmed, in case anybody here is trying to jump on me, but it doesn't seem to be the case. So let's see, what do we have here? Maybe something interesting? Nope. Okay, never mind, actually there is something here. What is this? Canned vegetables, okay, that is beyond disappointing. Um, but I'm kind of, you know, hungry, so I need to, like, eat that. Baked beans, yeah, I'm gonna take that too. You know, it's funny that I just got a bonus in HP for beating a couple of guys. Take newspaper scrap. What is this? I'm not gonna say no to that, but let's inspect the car we just got. $200 reward. Ran away from the... Uh, whatever that is. On the night of August 17th. Who calls himself... Who calls himself what? I'm covering it with my finger. He is stoutly made about... Whatever years of age. 5.9 inches tall. And yeah, he wears his hair somewhere along those lines. I will give a reward of $200 for his apprehension and the return of said boy to the Rhodes Jail or on my property at Shady Bell, Scarlet Meadows in the state of Lemoyne. Interesting. What can this even be? So this is like a bounty, except it's a private bounty? But how do we find this person? That sounds... Interesting. So, I don't think there's anything on the map indicating that there's another person that I need to search, is it? Actually, let me just put this sign over here. There it should it be. Um, yeah, by the looks of it, I'm not seeing anything out of, uh, out of the ordinary. I'm just going to check things out around this cabin. And, yeah, I don't think there's anything here, actually. Oh, inspect. 
Oh, there is something under the wood. And it's green? What is that? There's something scribbled on the ground. I'm not really sure what that is. But we did just find a family photograph. Okay, this is getting interesting. I thought that this cabin would be pointless. But it seems that somebody was living here. Okay. Nothing on the back. Nothing indicating who this was. But it's actually quite interesting. What is this on the ground, though? Does anybody know what this is? There are some scribbles, some scratches. A couple of shackles, it seems. Okay, this might have been a dungeon. Okay, probably somebody was a prisoner here. He was kept in here probably uh, for some time until he escaped or she escaped. Maybe that was his hidden photo of his family. That sounds actually cruel, dude. Now I'm sad. This is actually sad, you know. I mean, Rockstar Games is definitely putting a ton of effort into, like, everything in this game. But once you, like, discover a little bit of it, there's a lot of sad stories in this game. Jesus. Okay, never mind. Let's just go to that house. And uh, it should be really close. As a matter of fact, it should be right around these woods. Okay, so this is it then. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead all sneaky. I don't think there's anybody outside, hopefully. Okay, there's somebody home. I reckon you had enough, Pop. Enough? All I had enough of is you. We ain't had food in the keep for weeks. Oh, well, you ain't a babe in the crib no more. You full grown now, boy. Stop pulling in your pieces. You'd only gamble or piss it away if I did. You damn maggot. <sighs> Who the hell you think you talking to? You need to learn some respect. This is why my left. Look what happened to you. Okay, that was not good. Oh, there's someone in oh, the house. Oh, god damn it. Nate, go to your room. Yes, pal. Uh, get on out of here. Diffuse? Oh, there, partner, you hear me? Take it easy. Get the hell out of my house. Now. Yeah, that was not going according to plan. Okay, the kid is creeping me out now. <laughs> Maybe if I just come inside and just, you know, uh, talk like civilized people. Fine, I'm gonna go. Uh, what is he gonna do anyway if I stay inside the house? It's not like he can't do anything. He's drunk and he has a bottle of rum stick to his face. The kid is already creeping me out. He's... Okay, that is not good. God damn it. Okay, this is not good. Don't. Don't shoot him. Just beat. There you go. Did he die? Okay, I didn't mean to kill him. I just wanted to, like, just knock him out. God damn it. Well, that didn't go as planned. Um, I don't think there's any other option out here except for taking down the father. But it seems that he's having his problems of his own. I mean, he was a drunk, abusive to his child, and, uh, yeah, I think I'm doing him a service. But... Check this one out. <laughs> we have the double barrel shotgun, ladies and gents, all free. And it's actually quite cool because you can get it uh, quite early on into the game. It just needs a little bit of cleaning. It seems that nobody ever paid attention to it, which is a damn shame because the double barreled is one of the best looking shotguns in the game. At least with the beautiful silver finishing. Oh, yeah. Look at this beauty. Yes. It's perfect for aiming at somebody's face. But uh, I think there is still the son that we need to take care of. And I'm going to try not to kill him. But in the meantime, you know, I'm just going to search through his belongings. Let's see, what do we have in this house? I mean, the poor bastard was talking about some hidden stash. We uh, kind of need a hidden stash of money. We just have some gin. Okay, that is not good. Need something better than this. Come on. Is that it? Just gin all over the place? Why does he even need alcohol? He has alcohol all over the place. Yeah, the poor uh, stranger is actually dead as hell. And uh, maybe I should have not done that. If there's any other way you guys can uh, keep this guy alive and not kill him, yeah, be my guest. That would be actually interesting. But I couldn't. He died. He died for his sins. Oh, letter. Okay, let's inspect this. What does this even read? Dearest Nate. Okay, actually, this is a letter to the sun. Love always. 
Mama, okay. Um, uh, that actually makes sense. I mean, why is this uh, child still living with his completely abusing parent? Yeah, sounds like a rough, rough childhood. But uh, it's probably going to become even rougher because I'm going to search everything in the house. Now let's go. No, please don't kill me. Take whatever you want. Just, just leave. Yeah, I will do that. Thank you. Oh yes, cigarette cards. This is what I came no, for. Come on. My mom gave that card to me. Well, your mama ain't here. No. Well, I think my debt I just increased, so I'm being rewarded for being a jackass. Oh, me one of them at least. Well, what can I do? I mean, the game is rewarding me, clearly. It's something good. You know, actually, this is quite sad. I'm really saddened by this, and I kind of don't want to steal anything. But, you know, it's important for my missions. Oh, God. Oh, come on, kid. I ain't doing nothing. Okay, there's nothing here. See? See how much stuff I'm leaving for him? There's nothing here. Okay, maybe there's this huge chest. It should be containing something interesting, isn't it? Cocaine gum. Hmm, that is highly illegal. I will take that. Candy. <laughs> needs uh, inspecting. Premium cigarettes. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna have to, like, smoke the current cigarettes that I have. Ah, uh, yes. Nice. Hopefully I don't start a fire with that. But now I'm going to take the premium cards and <laughs> yes, we have gotten another one. Pretty sweet. Let's inspect the card now. Um, can you like tell me where your stuff is? Tell me where you keep the money or I swear I'll kill you right there. The chimney. It's in the chimney. Just please don't hurt me. Okay, that makes sense. I'm gonna leave him be. God damn, that is actually sad. Maybe I am a piece of shit. Oh, yep, I am. It's now confirmed. $50, but I am now a piece of shit, officially. Yeah, I'm gonna go now. Sorry about that, mister. I didn't actually want to do this, but the game pointed me towards something interesting here. It's just so sad that you actually have to, like, step on these people's properties, on their feelings. And he's still crying, Jesus. I can hear him from the outside. You know what? This box... Is definitely not going to contain anything cool. Aged pirate rum. Okay, maybe that is cool. Coin sack. Thank you. See, I knew there was something here. 12 bucks. God damn it. And some chewing tobacco. Well, at least I got myself a nice double barrel shotgun. Pretty decent. And yeah, this was today's video, guys. If you enjoyed it, then let me know in the comment section below. In the meantime, a like and a subscribe would be super appreciated. And uh, I will see you guys in the next one. So peace out.